Well, that puts uh, Cyclones behind the eight ball because the next four are definitely their favorites. The next two are favored for Iowa. The, next, the last two are favored for Iowa State. Right now, Iowa leads by six. Iowa State's got to change one of those uh, next two matches of favorites here. We start at 174 pounds. Duke Burke, the junior, 2-0, ranked eighth, going up against Jay Borschel, the junior, 8-0, ranked second. This is the first time I've watched Burke wrestle. Do we know anything about him? Transfer from Northern Illinois. He was uh, ended up in the round of 12 last year, which They're is one win away from being an All-American. These two wrestled last year, too. And um, Borschel, major decision, Burke, 10-1 to 1 at the Midlands. So they've seen each other, and Borschel's had it his way. And he started out that way, too. That's Pretty easy, because too. Because he knew where he was. He kept the foot in, had the toe right in bounds. Two points real fast for Jay Borschel. Elbow last and hold it. Okay, here we go. Red's tight, green at you. You know, we've re seen very few, you know, those face to shoelace type scrambles that tend end up taking a minute, minute and a half, or these a lot of very clean uh, technique once these wrestlers get in on the legs here. That's, that's good coaching, that's uh, you know, good style. And those, those finishes only take two to three seconds. And uh, it tells you the quality of wrestlers that we have out here today. Borschel, a junior from Marion, Iowa, Linmar High School. He's also left the state and go to Virginia Tech when Tom Brands was out there, came back. All-American last year in his first year in the lineup at 174 for the Hawkeyes. Linmar High School, Coach uh, Doug Stryker, former um, All-American here for the Hawkeyes. Right. Red in there, red down. Hold on, fellas, give me a second here, hold on. <coughs> All right, let's try this. Go, red go. in there, let's go. Burke from Notre Dame, High school in Peoria, Red Illinois. Down. Started in Northern right. Illinois. Red transferred movement. here Green. Elbow to, Iowa, or to Iowa State. Set. Ready. Green on. Of course, has always been really tough in the top position. Does a nice job of controlling the hips. Drops back we in. Got and room. We've got room. Controlling the hips. Keep working. Always been pretty good at that. Had an opportunity to watch him through his career at Green Linmar up. Marion. And what amazed me about him was that he went from uh, 103 pounds to 171, I think, yep. in, in four, four years. Four years and so he won the state four times, and you very I've never heard of that, from going to 103 and all the way up to winning at 171. And yeah, being a four-time state champ, just amazing. And uh, it, he, he looks bigger this year, you know, out there. Hey, we're gonna hold it, okay? Get in there. Probably could hold up pretty well at 184. Well, I've actually been around longer than you guys, so I've heard of it before, but but uh, I think it was Don Jr. Buzzard. Uh, I think he wrestled 120. No, and won four state titles. Oh, no, no. That's, no, no that's what I'm talking about. No, no, no. Oh, yeah. To win four state titles, I've, I've never heard of it. To go jump that far, yeah. Yeah, yeah he, uh, I think he was 120 and ended up like 189 his senior year. Uh, a little bit, this is a little bit like what you are talking about earlier. Where do you come to point in time where you... You think uh, you're not going to score them back Got points right away. You're going to get some more takedowns. So. Down for right got, uh, just on cue here, Borschel going goes into the uh, okay, Red, we're going optional, optional go. start. Red in, green. I think he heard you. Well, I was thinking that you were talking. Red, oh, is that it? Was it? <laughs> I can't even remember. Two to one in favor of Borschel. Now he gives Burke the escape here at 174 pounds. Big meet between Iowa State and Iowa. Carver Hawkeye setting a World record for college dual meet uh, attendance, 15,995. Never before have this many seen and viewed a college wrestling meet. Borschel's just smooth out there. Again, he had an opportunity to break the grip. The grip was broken, didn't quite spin around, but there he's in a position. Yeah, missed it. Missed it, look at this, come back. Good I don't know how he did that. You know, he just got that knack. He's just smooth. Good hips. But he, but he, but he knows when to lower his hips and drive through the man. Exactly. I mean, that's, that's what he did. It looked like he just man. fell off down. Yeah, and there was a, a, a chance where a lot of younger wrestlers will throw their rear end out and try to get out of that. He dropped and drive. Dro yeah. It was hard to see it from this angle. Here we go. 
Good spin around situation. Both athletes reacting lively here, but spin around, caught drop. on his heels, drop and drive. Lower those hips. Okay, set, red. Hey, elbow last and hold. Okay, elbow last and hold. Take hold. Beginning in the second period. Borschel from Iowa, out front four to one. Two takedowns in the first period, Jay Borschel had. One and neutral, green. Duke Burke. Escape for Borschel. The Hawkeye also has a lot of riding time, minute 40 built up. In on the leg again, but kind of a, he's squashed on that one though. Uh, be hard to come out of that one. Just keeps on moving in when he has the opportunity. Wasting a lot of time here though. Both sides actually. Yeah, this is a scoring opportunity for both men, and we we'll see uh, much action there to come back up to the feet. An attempt there by Iowa State's Burke. Spin around, came back in on the leg. Again, Borschel just does, never gets flustered out there. He just keeps the same expression, almost the same exp the same pace all the way through the match. Keep improving it. This is not, it's kind of a, not a scoring position really for his opponent. Mike Haggerty, the official, puts them both back up. Stalemate. Real, real important 35 seconds for both, both teams here. One's thinking about a major and the other's got to be thinking about getting back in the match. Well, at this point in the match, I mean, you, what do you drill? Your go-to shot. You know, sometimes you have, you have to wait till the end of the match to hit it, but this is a go-to shot situation, and what is it? And, and really, for both re both wrestlers, Jim, yeah, um, for, for what they're trying to accomplish. If you're gonna if you're gonna win this match, you need to score here. If you're Burke, yeah, and, and Burke had double inside tie there and didn't go to anything. And we're at the end of the second period. It is five to one in favor of. Jay Borschel got both his takedowns in the first period, got an escape in the second period, nothing mu much more. Now Burke goes Red down. down. Okay, here we go. Lock down another good It would have been a different Green match if right Burke would have been able to score there in the last, last 35 seconds Red. as Dan Red pushed, uh, um, alluded to, and then to have the bottom position. Five to one though is uh, Borschel's uh, lead as we enter the third period. Marshall looking for, looks like he's looking for some back points. Good old fashioned head lever right there. Put your forehead in the back of his, uh, back of his arm, grab the wrist. Burke's doing a really good job of keeping his left arm out of position for a chicken wing or an arm bar. When he's getting in there, he's pulling it under. A smothering ride by Jay Borschel, who's out in front five to one. He's got riding time, it can't be erased. So he's got a five point lead right now. Content, it looks like, with riding Burke out. Here's another one of these uh, that he's dominating the match, but it's not gonna get a major. And what tactics do you use to get one? You, right now, it's probably you need to go. go for a back point. Warning stalling on the Iowa State wrestler. Burke. That's the first warning, no points. 30 seconds left in the match. A three point near fall would allow Go that um, major to happen. But I think Burke knows that. Hey, You're guys, not gonna see. This up. Let's work, both of you. Yeah, he'll no, take like, another stalling. Yeah, he'll take right not middle. much of an effort Elbow to get out and, and, and uh, optional. Uh, optional start. Ready, take hold. Five to one in favor of Jay Borschel, who one just neutral. lets Burke uh, go. Now it's five to two. Burke back in on a shot. Great defense by Borschel. Looking to try to put him on his back, but Duke, uh, uh, Duke Burke felt that too. So he hung his leg out by his head too long, nothing. so the guy was able to reach nothing. up because he was definitely in position to get the takedown early. Still nothing. 
keep that head, you keep that leg by the guy's head. That's where these guys that scramble real good, they're going to keep you from uh, scoring. That leg has to be with your body. And he leaves his legs behind him a lot. It costs him there in the takedown. Yeah, most of the scoring in the first period when the two takedowns were uh, achieved by Jay Borjo, you're looking at him right there. Four-time state champ from Linmar High School. The pride of Linmar comes off the All-American last year. Now a winner tonight against Iowa State. 